these greedy corporations like Ford, General Motors, and Chrysler, they're making record profits. But how are they making profits? <laughs> By cutting wages down to 50% in many cases. And eventually, they want to cut all our wages to $14 an hour, which is one and a quarter times the poverty rate for a family of four. And that's not right, not when they're making billions upon billions at our expense. And one person that brought this important issue of fighting concessions, of fighting two-tier, brought it to the floor of the UAW convention is brother, uh, a committeeman from Local 600, Brother Gary Walkowitz. Good afternoon, everybody. You know, every year when they have the auto show in Cobo Hall, they celebrate and display all the new automobiles and trucks, but they always seem to forget about the people, the men and women who built the cars and trucks, which is all of us, okay? Yeah. Right now they're talking about uh, the, uh, the profits that auto companies are making, all right? Now, who was it who, who created those profits for the auto companies? It was us, the auto workers who did that. The, the whole theme of 2010 in Detroit has been a turnaround for the auto companies. Well, I say that 2011 needs to be a turnaround for the auto workers. Yeah. Yeah. In the last five years, they have brought down our standard of living. They have created a second-class citizen among your other workers, a two-tier people living in a way that's barely above poverty level. Yeah. That's that's what they want for our gen next generation and they eventually want for us. They destroyed the promises that were made to retirees that they could that they retire with a secure retirement. That's gone with the FIBA. Right. Okay? That's what's happened to us the last five years. And 2011 needs to be a year of turnaround for auto workers, okay? We start the turnaround by saying no. The Ford workers said no, the Indianapolis workers said no, the Alpha workers said no. That's the first step. The next step has to be this year with a new contract, we should demand and expect to get back everything we gave up that we need to be fighting for. Thank you.